Hello friends and welcome you all back to the channel. Happy to see you all once again in another Clash of Titans video. So this is the long awaited, uh, actually it is not a long awaited video, uh, it is the ro most recommended video. So many of you have asking me for the air all tutorial for like 2-3 days I think after releasing him. So today I made my time to make this video. So hope you will enjoy it so this is uh, basically a guide video so i think this video will be helpful for you so for the last video which is the nakroth uh, with the legendary skin spotlight gameplay with a guide so i have thought of making a giveaway for that video if that video hits uh, 300 likes but it's like a 1.3 way ahead so uh, completed uh, yeah 1.3 uh, goal is completed and uh, like 100 I think I got 100 likes for that and it's keep going on so the limit is 5 days and I hope it will reach 300 before 5 days so let's go on to today's video so as for Errol friends Errol is one of the strongest warrior and but uh, he's not so strong in the late games so he's a pretty good early game hero so his damage is so lot in the early games and also he is pretty sustainable too so his abilities are like uh, his s1 uh, is a small dash which can reach you help to reach your enemies and the theory s2 is a very great crowd control so your s2 is a pretty pretty good lifesteal and uh, it has a pretty higher damage area and you also can deal a lot of damage with it and also it has a pretty good lifesteal and now your ultimate so when you use your ultimate you will like uh, go untargetable for like uh, three seconds after that you will land on an enemy stunning them and uh, during the time of your ultimate you can just uh, i mean you can damage deal damage to the enemies and uh, you can get stacks for your s1 so i mean stacks for your s2 so if you don't get any stacks for your s2 and you just uh, i mean like uh, not any stacks if you get uh, four stacks or or less than four I mean less than five stacks then you will like uh, you can't do the crowd control thing with your s2 so otherwise if you get five stacks and uh, if you use your s2 then your damage will be high and uh, your uh, crowd control will be also very good decent so if you hit your enhanced S2 perfectly, I mean uh, not your enhanced S2 uh, but no, also your normal S2. So if you hit on one enemy, you can uh, get the get one stack and if you hit more than one enemy and uh, I mean according to how much enemies, I mean how much targets you hit like uh, even it uh, counts with the minions. So if you hit like uh, three minions and uh, two enemies, then you will instantly get the five stacks and you can uh, like uh, go for the next s2 so whenever you uh, make a normal attack then you will get that stacks for your s2 so after getting that stacks your normal attacks will become uh, like your attack speed will be increased and after that your uh, lifesteal is also uh, increased a little for your normal attacks then your normal attacks will also reduce the cooldown of your s2 after you're getting five stacks <laughs> So as I said before, uh, the enhanced, I mean like uh, your ultimate can give you the stacks for your en enhanced S2, right? So if you use your ultimate and uh, you have like zero stacks and after you using your ultimate, you can deal damage to the enemies, right? At that time, you can uh, deal a lot of damage to the enemies and uh, that will give you stacks for your S2. So with that stacks you can deal a lot of damage and here okay now let us see about the match so this match is a pretty good uh, match in the early game so I just got like uh, 5 kills and 2 assists and which is the uh, total participation of me and uh, that is the total things done by our team and it is going perfectly well in the early games so if you go to the late games guys uh, the thing is Errol can be killed very easily so if you build him squishy he will uh, I mean he can be killed easily and if you build him tanky then he will be useless so he can't deal a lot of damage and uh, he can just use his S2 to stun the enemies but if you uh, enemies don't have uh, 
person to deal damage from the back line then it will be like a total uh, waste of you trying to uh, engage in and uh, with a tanky sustain build and uh, getting damage inside that uh, five men like uh, i mean like if you are like jumping inside a five men uh, five enemy teammates are there and uh, you are trying to uh, get some damage from them and trying to wait for your marksman or mage to deal damage at the back lines but they are not doing so so it was like a very bad uh, thing guys so for here all late game is very bad and for now here guys i just missed my s2 so if i got my uh, like life steal if i hit uh, alain then i would have just survived and killed julian 2 but i missed it and uh, that's what i died there so this is what happens if you miss your s2 so your s2 should land on an enemy if you use your s2 so if it doesn't lands then you don't have a life steal and uh, you will die for sure so after i mean like uh, i will tell you the drawbacks of if, uh, missing this missing your s2 right okay so if you miss your s2 you won't get uh, the stacks for your s2 okay the first one and the second one you don't have a life steal so it will be very easy for the enemy team to kill you i, I mean enemies i any want to kill you so for the third thing if you miss your s2 then it will have a lot of cooldown and uh, you won't get an another chance to make it uh, i mean another chance to get your s2 and uh, use it on the enemies and here it was a perfect timing by me but uh, like uh, i just i should have waited for uh, zil to land after using his ultimate so before that i used my s2 so that i just uh, okay uh, anyways we died there so even though i waited for him and after that i used me, uh, there is a chance i would have died because uh, of uh, abnath so he is also dealing damage and uh, if i waited uh, for a little more time then uh, if abnath does something for me then he would kill me so before that i should have killed him so that it uh, happened like that okay uh, sometimes i will miss my s2 there so i i'm not a so much pro with air all and uh, i'm i'm not so happy with i uh, so happy to say that but um, okay it's kind of like uh, so i'm just uh, using uh, so this is a uh, jungle game play i'm just say saying it right now right so jungle air all is pretty good and to uh, op2 <clears throat> yeah like uh, if you can't uh, lane with air all you can just go for jungle if you want to try him so here i was like uh, trying to attack their marksman but uh, this guy's stuns were like uh, so irritating for me see he is like pushing here and there and uh, so much am i <clears throat> so i can't concentrate in the match <laughs> so like uh, now we are trying to get this tower and guys uh, when you play here all keep this in mind uh, try to end the match as soon as possible so if it goes on to like uh, after 12 minutes then it will be out of your hand your team has to carry you then you can't carry your team so right now i am carrying the team that you can see clearly i think so so after 12 minutes then i will get banged a lot and uh, it will be very hard for us so alan is pushing the top lane and i, sh I thought uh, rayoma will help me to clear the slayer but he is not he is busy in clearing the mid lane with our teammates and uh, i am just trying to get the stacks of my jungle and uh, before entering into a fight uh, try to get uh, three or four stacks from the enemy i mean like uh, from the jungle creeps and after that you try to engage and here friends i did the entirely dumbest thing in my entire life and that was i thought uh, the tulens ultimate will be blocked by uh, the dog slayer and i just uh, spawned it <laughs> but it didn't and uh, we unfortunately lost the slayer without doing anything so like uh, it, uh, after i survived and uh, i thought that i know i i already know that uh, slayer want to block his ultimate then why did i spawn there and uh, i was like oh so 
I am so dumb guys and okay it's what it is and now let's go to the bottom lane and try to kill the marksman but anyway uh, slims managed to kill him I don't know how <coughs> and uh, in this match guys uh, slims was literally uh, if i like he will always throw his s1 at any of the enemies and if the s1 hits the enemies i mean any any one of the enemy he will uh, without hesitation he will just jump into the enemies and uh, try to kill them uh, even though all the stunts and uh, like even though no one is near him he will just go in and uh, kill try to kill them and uh, eventually he will die because four of them will be there and he single handedly jumps on to them and uh, he will try to kill them so that is the dumbest thing i i mean he will do and uh, here that was a perfect block by me to i mean uh, block by me who for alliance ultimate so like uh, he was trying to ult on me and uh, before he lands i used my ultimate to dodge that one so it was like a perfect uh, pro play but uh, it looks like pro play for me but i don't know how it looks like for you <laughs> okay <clears throat> and now uh, my teammates are like uh, trying to end this match as soon as possible so i'm just uh, crying to them please end this match as soon as possible i am doing uh, like i am doing very good in this match uh, not very good to like uh, if you uh, i mean like i uh, okay i i i don't want to comment that and uh, my team i said them to retreat uh, before i come here to attack the abyssal dragon but uh, they didn't and now they are dying to the enemy team so i can't leave them uh, dying like this because uh, if they die then it will be very hard for me to solo carry actually i'm not solo carrying uh, even uh, now either so okay so now i am is attacking the slayer and uh, i don't know how could he attack the slayer with the abyssal buff and i just started attacking the slayer and after the damage i deal to the slayer <laughs> then i convinced me to come back because uh, it won't it, it's not going to happen okay here uh, zil managed to uh, come and help his friend i mean uh, help his teammate oh crap i miss my s2 so this is what happened if i miss my s2 see the damage guys so if i would have used i mean if i would have got my s2 perfectly onto their uh, zil then i would should have i mean i would have uh, got a little life steal and uh, could get a perfect hit on their uh, what what uh, ebdeth too so but uh, i missed it and here i was standing outside the tower okay so without minions i can't go into the tower right but anyway it's like <laughs> take money <clears throat> so now uh, we are just trying to get all the towers and uh, finish the match as soon as possible they are killing the waves like crazy because uh, their tulen is dealing a lot of damage and i don't know how okay here uh, that was a misplay by me but even though uh, my teammates just uh, managed to get the kill to their zil and uh, now there are only three of them i think so so we are just trying to attack the towers in two lanes and uh, that uh, two lane is so much irritating to me and here we are just trying to attack the core but it didn't happen and our back just missed our uh, missed his precious s2 in the process of uh, hooking their marksman but uh, anyway their marksman is not dealing so much damage but uh, he will deal after like uh, 15 minutes so after that uh, both the team will get so much of gold and uh, they will deal a lot of damage and uh, here i chose the wrong target and uh, anyway i got my uh, what was that ha huh, blade of eternity so i will try to i i can manage to kill nobody and uh, i am just retreating oh crap i i was literally like uh, focused on attacking their tank and it was the dumbest uh, it was also a dumbest thing i uh, i always do and oh uh, no no not always uh, like sometimes i will do and uh, my like uh, a grack was alan stanch uh, who is uh, with me in this match and uh, 
he is the drag so alain was hitting him and i was hitting their tank and uh, both of them uh, perfectly did what we did and uh, okay i should have killed him so uh, for here i should have uh, ran away because uh, i know his back up see this is the thing i said guys this is the thing so if he uses his s1 and uh, someone got hit on the s1 and uh, he will jump on them and die okay if it's enough okay so like uh, i was saying don't for uh, their um, for our marksman but uh, that don't uh, meant nothing for him and uh, he was he will go and die again uh, you will see that so if their tulen is like uh, playing pro plays and uh, here our rayoma is too dumb that uh, he doesn't know that uh, tulen will get his ultimate back after killing natalia so my teammates are also as dumb as me so no offense uh, so like uh, i i am in so much pain so asking that question why guys and now see see uh, see our uh, cute little boy see this is this is what he will do whenever uh, his s1 hits anyone and here i was trying to f i mean i was fully focused on uh, what uh, who the hell was that a uh, tulan yeah <clears throat> i was fully focused on tulan because i was uh, i am completely got raged on him so he is like using his ultimate only using his ultimate and uh, he is standing at the back and trying to kill uh, i mean not trying to kill he is killing everyone and here this yeah this is again he is doing it again and again guys he is just using his s1 jumping in and uh, he is not uh, aware of the after life like i mean what is going to happen and then he is like literally jumping in and dying uh, I, <laughs> i i can't explain that guys i uh, i think a little baby can know that uh, in the late games a ds laner can kill a marksman very easily so if you are like a uh, pro god of uh, marksmans uh, uh even though if you are a pro god of marksmen uh, sometimes there is a, uh, there are some no uh, ds laners who can kill them easily so he is not uh, worry about i mean worrying about them and he is just uh, trying to jump on them and killing and here natalia was perfect uh, so even though i bought my uh, what was that magic defense i am getting so much of damage from zill and i don't know how guys so this is what i said guys this is the late game of erol looks like see this is the late game of erol looks like so um, see again uh, our uh, cute little uh, squirrel did the same thing again not the squirrel i think squirrel is phoenix so this is rabbit so and uh, now we are losing our core so yeah this is the last match guys uh, so this will be a perfect example for not to play how not to play at all and uh, he is a early game hero please don't try to make uh, pros skills uh, and uh, making the game to the late game and no one picks him in the tournament matches because of this so if there is a game left on to the late games then it will be a sure loss I mean I don't say that uh, sure loss if your team plays good then his crowd control will be helpful for your team and uh, it will help your team to win the match so <clears throat> that's all for today's video friends hope you all enjoyed it and find it helpful so if you find it helpful please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel so friends see you all in the next video until then bye bye and have a great day